Hi, this is John Fallows uh, with an interesting uh, video, short video, on a proof of concept to uh, try to see if I could create short wave listening speech translation in real time. Now, I'm a long way from that, but this first proof of concept, I thought, I wonder if I can record a foreign speaking short wave station and get it to translate to text uh, while I'm listening to it. I haven't found a way to do it in real time yet, but I found that if I record a uh, signal, I can play it back on the computer and get, uh, get a translation. So what I'm going to use here is a 20 second clip of uh, Radio Japan NHK on 11815 this morning, and then I'm going to take that recording and put it into Microsoft's Azure, uh, their speech translation app, and see what comes out. So first of all, here is the clip from NHK uh, as it actually sounded on the radio this morning. So obviously I didn't understand a word he was saying, <laughs> uh, which is why I'm sort of wondering if I can get uh, the computer to translate shortwave broadcast. So now I'm going to use this speech translation app from Microsoft Azure. I'm going to set the source language to uh, Japanese. Where are we at? There we go. And I'm going to have a target language of English, which is what I want to hear. And you see here it says upload file. So if I drag this Japanese speech file over to the app, or if I just use the uh, selector, Let's see what happens. So it's playing right now, and the uh, app is actually translating it. So what the Japanese speaker was actually saying was the Nikkei stock average on the Tokyo stock market fell by more than 1,800 yen yesterday at the beginning of the week in the wake of the speech by Chairman Powell of the Federal Reserve Board of the Federal Reserve. The central bank of the U.S., which uh, was held at the end of last week, there was a heightened sense of alarm that the global economy would cool down, and it was almost a total decline. <laughs> so that's what he said. So you can uh, take a listen again. So there's my first experiment, a uh, 20 second clip of Japanese from NHK, uh, translated online by Microsoft uh, Azure uh, speech translation demo app. And so I'd invite you, you might try this, uh, do a few short clips in different languages. I think popular ones would be Spanish, Portuguese, German. Uh, I've done Arabic. Uh, I've done Korean and Mandarin. And they all worked, but the Japanese one worked the best. Anyway, there's a short proof of concept. The day may not be too far away when we shortwave listeners could actually use real-time speech-to-text translation while we're listening to foreign stations. This is John V6EY making it up.